That's right. We're back in the cargo hub. Uh, there's our passenger train hanging out over there. There it goes. Looking good. Let's check in on our line progress here. Let's check our balance and stuff. So looks like grain delivery right now is doing really well. We're at up 119,000, 101,000 on refined oil. Uh, these things have finally started delivering stuff, so we're actually making money off of them. Uh, there's our passengers right now. 41,000. We're full up. Or 18 of 18 right now. Oh, no. That's not. That's our train right there. 28 of 28. So let's uh, go hang out with that guy as we head down the line here. And, yeah, we are doing pretty good. Uh, I've let it run for a few little bit just so we can get money. And my thought always was is that just don't want to spend all my money right away you know what i mean because i do that i spend all my money right away and i don't always wait for things to um money to build up and then i'm you know you, you run into issues after, at that point so yeah there we go there's our passenger train it is looking dirty and dingy as you would in 1901 anyway so watch her come into the stop here Auto save the real hero. We've got 71 passengers waiting. We just made $179,000 off of the 28 passengers. So, hey, that's pretty darn amazing. We, I am not going to adjust this. I'm going to just let it. I could probably add an additional coach, probably. It's so like if we come over here, how many passengers do we have waiting at Corona right now? 77. So we could adjust it a little bit and add in maybe another coach. So let's let's actually do that. Let's check our vehicles. And that is one of these. Ah, we could just do this because we only have we only have one. And then we would do edits, and we could put it on another passenger car. All right, so we added a third passenger car on there. Hopefully that will, what's that bring us up to? 42 passengers. So that'd be nice, uh, get those 42 passengers in. So what I think we're going to do today is, is that... Again, I'm trying not to rush things, but what I want to do is because everything's very expensive in this game, right? So we're going to come over here and we're going to configure this terminal. And what we're going to do is we're going to actually add in a the cargo terminal here. So put this in, this in, and I don't think we have one here. So we're going to start off with two. because, And the reason I'm doing this is because I want to like edit edit <laughs> edit the things and make it look good. So we're going to start off with a with a small cargo building right now. And so we're going to put that guy in there. And again, there's no cargo going to be going here at this moment, but I want to decorate is what I want to do. So if we can. It just depends on how much money it costs, right? So, like I said, things in this game are not cheap. So you have to be very careful about what you do. So we're going to spend 54000 We're going to remove a house. That's some eminent domain right there. That way we have connection to our cargo station. So that's all connected up. And then what I think we're going to do is... We're going to, let's go ahead and put in a track in right here. And we're just going to bring it out, but we're not going to do anything with it. So this is just futureness, basically, because we don't have any cargo over here, right? I usually start this way is usually better. Yeah. All right, there we go. So there's our future cargo lines. Come in here, you know, cargo cargo stuffs. 
That's for when the, the hub is really rolling. Uh, also, so what I want to do is I want to throw in, because th these things are most likely going to change, right? So let's also grab some of this, and we will go like this. That's up higher. So then what we'll do is go like this. Just doing a little bit of decorating here. Kind of make it look like a normal train station kind of deal. I think I heard some... I don't know if that was chickens, what that was. There we go. So get those in. And then let's go ahead and... Can we... Those are turkeys, is what they are. They're turkeys. And again, these aren't going anywhere, right? So these are just fake tracks. So we'll get the fake tracks in over here, and then what we're going to do is... Let's extend this guy out a little bit. Now, is that higher than the other one? I think it is. Let's delete that. Let's come back in here and actually start here. Oh, and the AI is like, oh, you're building over here? Let me also build over here. Silly AI. <laughs> um, then we'll actually throw a couple tracks in over here on this side. And we're going to put those all the way for right now. All the way to the end. As close as we can get them. To... To the platform. Sorry, sometimes I think in my head and I don't say words. It's just how it is. Just how it be. Too much curvature. Oh, okay. Can I... Can we... Could a guy... Too much curvature. Hmm, 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 hmm. Actually, let's do this then. Because, again, these are just fake tracks, so it's not like they need to be fancy. Kind of like that. And what's going to happen is, is that I don't think I can extend that any farther. I can. Let's get it all the way to the end. There we go. All right, so we got those in, and so then what we're going to do is we will come over here to this, get our paint tools, and then we're going to search for ballast. Select some ballast. And make our brush size smaller. And we're going to see how much this is going to cost us. Actually, I don't think ballast costs us any money. Let's make our brush size just a hair smaller. That way we get some ballast along the edge of the the tracks. Fill it in all through here. As a train comes in. So my thinking was is that I didn't want to 
just build, 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 build. You know what I mean? Like, the whole idea of the cargo hub and this series is to build a huge cargo hub. And, <clears throat> excuse me, by that I mean we have a big map. And no sense rushing and doing everything else. And this is not a four-episode series. This is a multi-season, multi-episode series. And so the way things are going to work for the Cargo Hub and the other series going forward is, is that they'll just have, as of right now, this is the thoughts in my head, was is that just have series where it is, or seasons for our series, and make, because a lot of times, like, I come in here after... I'm done recording and I do all of this stuff that you're you're seeing right here and to me it would be fun just to show you here's everything I do and I spend hours upon hours doing just crazy stuff like this you know so now I have this in and so what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to throw in gonna come over here to the assets and what I'm going to try to find is, I think I can do a, is it, let's start here and let's go train and transportation, air, air, transportation rail. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select a depot and this is going to be a fake depot. Um... Oh, that might be too big to fit in here. So we're going to have to find something different, I think. Market stalls. Air one industrial. So like currently we're in basically like in the era one industrial, right? Maybe. We might be after that. We might be era two. Or era B. Industrial. So, like, we could throw in some industrial buildings over here. Which means I need to delete that tree. But also means I might have to flatten things. So... I'm thinking, like, this is a, a process of what should we do here. We can also just come over here to our train stuff. We don't have a Russian, China. And I, I want to be careful about how much I spend. These are all Russians. This might be... This might be the one we're using right now. Oops. I'm also not... I, I got to get used to using the... Uh... Okay, so we've got 194. Okay, so it's actually not costing us any money. That's good. Can we get a pass and... Nope. How about coach? Nope. That's boat. Oh, was that it? There we go. So let's throw some... Uh, let's see if we have any passenger coaches here. Negatory. Ooh, we could put a... So, like, over here... We can do... Like, some old-timey boxcars. And I know I have better ones than that. Just have to find them. That's signs. Is this it? Maybe they're in here. Maybe they haven't come out yet.
That could be. It could be just that they're not out yet. So what we're going to do is we're going to throw... Oh. Ground? Oh, it just sits on the ground. So what if I do a, a one? Does it make it bigger? So that goes to right there. I make it a one. I don't know. I don't know what it does. Forward, backward. Okay, so let's throw a couple box cars in over here. Like right here. Right here. Also, one thing you have to be careful with is you don't make it so there's too much stuff or it will mess up your your game will get messed up. So that's just as an FYI. I was hoping they had passenger coaches, but I'm not seeing any. So I'm going to throw like one of those there. I suppose we could go to here. Well, that's an asset builder. Don't want that. So we can come over here. Kind of look through this spot, see if there's anything good that we want to put in here. Yeah, I was really hoping for passenger coaches, but it doesn't look like we have any. So we're going to throw in maybe a couple of these, like some old looking. Oh, maybe some of these guys, too. I know they're not technically like US because I'm doing more US stuff and this is more for just interesting look anyway. Uh we could do one more. Let's do one more. Again, I don't know what those buttons do. And I think I can't delete it, so all in the name of making things look cool. Really, that's all this is. And we're not spending money. That's the best part. Like the assets apparently don't make you spend money, which is nice. Uh, residential. I kind of want... What does the commercial look like? Okay, that's what that is. I do want to throw some industrial over here. I don't know. Let's see. Maybe like this? And if we could... So I'm, I'm thinking in my head while we're doing this, right? So if we can put this here... And then we bring... A, an additional train line like not from right there
I know what we could do. It, it, the, the easy way to do this is to do this. Even then, it's very... Uh, maybe we could... We'll do this. So maybe not right there, but maybe we can do something like this. And then bring it down this way. Like that. And then come over to here and place it down. You know, something like that. Let's see what other industrial buildings we got. Like, we could do it like this. Um, can we make it a little bit wider? Yeah, so, like, we could put it right here. Like that. And maybe fix that, how it looks. Maybe put it in here like this. That way I don't have to mess with the... I don't have to mess with any of the, with the track that we have there. So then I can do... Well, I want that one. So let's actually delete this guy. Right here. I don't want to do the whole track. Okay, is it going to allow me to do this? Kind of like that. And then can I delete this? There we go. Look at that. And then we come back in with our ballast. And we can come in here and maybe do a little bit of... Let's see. Like that. Turkeys are just slaying me, dude. And say we don't like all this ballast over here. The nice part is, is that there is a delete. Um... Yeah, this. Racer tour. So we can delete some of that ballast. And then we can, again, come in here to our assets. And we can select our train assets. And we can do maybe a couple boxcars here. Like that. All right. So that's the building of a station, you know, like this is just a matter of just sitting down here and having, I don't know, ideas in your head of how you want it to, to look. And not even ideas in your head is just a matter of, I don't know, doing something. You know what I mean? I can clean this up a hair. Just too much ballast off to the side. And then maybe there's some coal. If I could spell it right. So we're going to turn the strength down on this. And we're going to say, you know. Maybe up a hair. Maybe some more hairs. Maybe we turn it up all the way.
I don't know. Maybe not. <laughs> I'm, I'm wrong here. <laughs> let's delete. Okay, so let's delete the ballast and see if I can put in coal. Okay, it all looks the same. Oh, there's some coal. It's not very much. What else we got besides coal? Dirty water. Gravel. I don't know. All looks the same, right? Oh, you can see a little bit. I'm probably going to, like, reload the save, and it'll just be everywhere, you know what I mean? Yeah, you can see a little bit right there. Maybe I need the brush size to be bigger. Oh, I think that's it. You can see it getting down there now. Yeah, so there's the start of our first station. And the cool part is, is that, like, I can also come in here because I don't think the AI is going to build, like, right in here. I can do the same thing, like, on this side where I'm putting in a factory and it's got cars and stuff I can put in. And the other thing is, is that, like, there's a lot more assets for industrial stuff. So I think I was doing Industrial Era 1. You know, like this, and there's little tiny houses. There's all kinds of different things that you can do. And, you know, like this one has like a, uh, we can do it like this to where it's next to the tracks. Well, let's delete this guy. Yeah, see how it's like next to the track, so now they can bring in stuff into the into the building right here. I'm just looking at it. And I wonder if I can do can I extend the road a little bit? So if we extend the road to say right there. It kind of gives the feel... I don't know. I don't know if I like that. I don't, I don't know that I like that. I don't, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Configure... Oh. Interesting. learning things today so I actually don't like that right there so let's delete that and then let's come back in here and maybe we move it maybe we move it down here a little bit what do we think about it right there I don't know I don't like that at all but you get the idea the world is your oyster for this So now we have a cargo station and we're kind of just getting into the whole idea of here's how we want our world to be. And I sound a lot like Bob Ross right there, you know, our, our happy little Corona station. But I mean, it is an, a matter of you making it how you want it to look. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to bring this road down all the way to right here. Which I think makes sense because then we can come in here and we can do 
just we can do some additional buildings and stuff which are kind of funky let's do this so maybe we put a building like right here on the corner very close to the track and we'll see how that looks Again, like I said, you have to be kind of careful about what you do with this because you can run into the issue of it killing your frame rates. So I'm going to throw down some asphalt right here. Okay, what does it look like? So the other thing is, is that like the game, it's made up into squares. I don't know if you if you know what I mean but it's it's made up in squares of like when we look at this square right here it shows that it's facing this way so like for me to get it into a straight line I'd have to go here 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 so it's like going diagonal from what I have right now if that makes sense may or may not so we're gonna do that and then I think check up here we'll put some just do this for right now let's see containers so like you know you can throw down boxes and, and whatnot so I actually want to do this like that now we can come over here to the assets and say we did some containers uh, dumpsters yeah, let's throw some dumpsters out here. Um, barrels, planks, dynamite. Some pallets. Oh man, you can get into a lot with this stuff. Awnings. So yeah, like let's get into adding in, there's like some walls and stuff. So you could put walls, oh man, so much stuff you can do here. this container look like? That's container one. That's container two. We're going to go another container one. Same size. Same size. Just some rubbish over there. And then, I mean, the same thing over here. Like, we can come over here and paint. And maybe we don't like that asphalt, but we like this asphalt a little bit. Throw that down. And then on this side, maybe we throw in some some dumpsters over here. Well, that's that was one. There's two. And that's dumpster three. Yeah, like that. Maybe a couple barrels here and there. This barrel. Now is that page up? I 
Kind of like that. And then maybe we have our container here. Oh, look at that, a horse and buggy. So again, like I was saying, like the world is literally your oyster when it comes to this game. Where do we want that guy? Oh, I think I want this instead. Look at that. Oh, that that's... Yeah, I like that. I'll lock that. Let's actually put this all the way down to here. Kind of like that. Oh man, that looks so much better. Because maybe this is a all of this stuff over here is tied to the same, the same thing. You know what I mean? Same place. Small box, box. Sure. And then we can make this bigger, right? Oh, you know what we could do is where is it? It's the planks. Can we make what is the height scale? So maybe over here. Like this. It's a little off, but that's fine. Because you can come in here and you can delete them. So maybe we just go with the flat ones for right now. I don't know. Let's, let's do this. Ball. Oh. Sorry, twitchy hand. Kind of like that. That is a giant dumpster. Because then you got to come back in here where you puts it on the ground. So let's go back to the boxes. Looking for good. Oh, I mean, let's. We could go with this. And then just rotate them a little bit. Kind of like that. Actually gives me a lot of City Skylines vibes when it comes to doing things like this. So yeah, there is... And we've already done almost 40 minutes. And that's, this is all we've done for this episode is just put in some decorations right here and i mean i like that i think that looks really good let's also do some trees which ones are the trees it would probably be the tree right here mixed trees brush size maybe put some mixed trees right there Yeah. And again, this is one of the things where you have to be careful with like how many trees and stuff you put in because the game will it, it's not awesome when it comes to some of the stuff and it will it, it'll slow down. So don't want to do any of that. So we got our trees in. Let's make sure it's not hitting the railroad line. Got our box cars right here. 
It's too bad we didn't have like a forklift. That'd be kind of cool uh, to get stuff out of there. Because I don't think they have... Benches. So what I was thinking about was... Oh, and then there's all sorts of industrial buildings like this. Chemical plants. Refinery, I guess. Industrial buildings. Industrial buildings. So you could do oil, oil, steel. We don't want that, quarry. Actually, industrial chimneys. Because then you can put in, you know some cool chimneys in. Pipes. All sorts of crazy stuff. What was I looking for? I don't even remember at this point. Oh, transportation. Radar station. Well, that's air. Air two. Air three, air four, air five. Rail ends. Lamps. Lamp. Must be fences. Depot. So I think some stuff comes along later on once you have get to new eras because I know like in some of my other games I have a lot more stuff but I'm also in like the 70s so I think that'll happen as we move forward in the game and we're still on June 30th of 1901 I almost said 2001 but 1901 so we're still making money. I mean, we're up to 4.6 million. And but that's the that's the idea of of this series is to come in and make things look good at our stations. It's not just a build it and make money kind of deal here. So I think that's one of the things that I definitely wanted to point out. Um but oh, look at this. Look at this crazy industrial building that just is right here. So build in some stuff, make our stations look good, and continue with a series where we are making money, but we're also having fun while we make that money. And so in the next episode, we're not going to do this every single time. Do I, do I need to double slip this? Sure. Um, in the next episode, what we'll be doing is we're looking at Corona and Oceanside, and our next closest town is Stockton or Toledo or Victorville. So if we're going to extend our passenger line, I think we should go over to Stockton. So let's look at that right now. We're not going to do that. So this is fairly flat over here across a couple. We'll have a couple bridges over the river, through the woods, and finally to grandmother's house we go. So maybe we extend over to Stockton. We'll make sure we check in on um, Oceanside because we'll have a couple, like we'll have to come through here. So we're going to have to destroy some stuff, come through here and over to Stockton. So that'll be in the next episode though. And again, like the, the one of the big things that I will be doing is I'm going to also maybe in the next episode or the episode after that, we're, we're going to be building our train depot. So it's not just going to be this thing right here we'll have an actual train depot where our trains come out of and i'm going to try to make it where we have one train depot for all of our trains and that's why you know connecting stockton right now and going around the map with from i'm sorry corona and then connecting over to stockton we're just doing all one loop through the entire thing so hey that's uh 
I know it's, it's it's a lot, and I think eventually this will change how this looks right into here. But for right now, this is this is what our plan is, and our Corona station is that where we're at? Corona, our Corona station does look fantastic. And that's the idea of this series. So you know, put your thoughts, comments uh, down below, and until next time here on the Cargo Hub, where we continue to make everything look amazing. Take care.